guys, I do apologize for all of the content I'm currently pushing out for you guys to watch, but I did tell you I was going to showcase each individual back bling on outfits. So I'm going to give you like roughly 24 outfits per back bling that they go well with. But one thing to note is the Dark Knight cape only wraps on him. Now, if I were to do the Dark Knight cape on the comic book Batman, it does not wrap. It just kind of sits there like we're used to seeing and vice versa if i use the comic book cape you can see it wraps and goes into his mask and around his neck so just keep that in mind the dark knight will not go on the comic book the way we want it to and the comic book will not go on the dark knight the way we might want it to so not only that we got our gotham city challenges done already we got a loading screen which is it's pretty cool and we got a banner icon a batman um logo we got the cat wing glider and then we got a spray the rest are just like xp not a big deal so i'm actually going to showcase the cat wing in game for you guys and then we'll get to the back playing showcases thanks for watching the cat wing glider here we go Ooh, it's a lot more quiet than i thought it was going to be you can hear that sound i like that it kind of scrunches in as you thrust I like the sound of it. Let's go backwards. Ooh, it kind of... Okay, so it does flex going forward and back. Go to the right. Go to the left. This looks really good. And this is available for everybody, guys. You don't have to buy any of the Catwing... Or, excuse me, the, uh, the Catwoman or the uh, Batman pack in the store section there. This is for free, just doing challenges. Let's equip again. It's really majestic. It looks really good, man. It sounds good, too. I like this. This is cool. First, we have the comic book Batman cape here. Now, obviously, it's all black. You can wear it on pretty much whatever you would like, but I'm just giving you a good idea in case you're unsure about it. Also, here's a fun fact. If you play the normal game and you go to Gotham City where tilted now tilted is now called gotham city you'll get this cape on any skin you're wearing so if i don't showcase a specific skin with um this cape that you want to see just drop into gotham city and you'll have the cape on you the entire time you're in there is it wrong to put a dc cape on a marvel character i still think it looks clean <laughs> the dark knight here we go Catwoman with her goggles on this is what it came with, but it's not going to show you the wrap until I select it. So now it's wrapped around him. So don't get confused there. Now it's wrapped. Um, unless it was already equipped, it's not going to show... Ooh, I'm lost here. The back bling wrapped on there yet, so... Back to my favorites. Okay, the Dark Red Knight. Looks pretty aggressive. Spider Knight. I like the way this looks with the points. It goes really well with this helmet. Hollowhead. It's got a good Halloween vibe. Let me talk to your manager. It should look good on the white edit style too. It does look good. I like that. Shadowbird. Not bad. A lot of black. Uh, of course, I had to show it on Clinical Crosser. We'll give you like a little brief overview here of some countries that will look good on. There's pretty much anything you could probably wear with this. But Clinical Crosser is my favorite uh, football outfit. So we'll just do all the countries. We might as well. We're, we're almost already halfway through, so... It's a nice cape though. It's very um, interactive in game. It looks really good in terms of like the wind blowing through it and stuff. It's really nice. It did really well with these. Now it does glitch a little bit through your character's feet when you're skydiving. But other than that, I think it's, it's fucking awesome, man. It looks really good. It's been a busy Saturday, man. It doesn't even feel like Saturday. It feels like we just got a brand new season, honestly. <laughs> With all the cosmetic stuff I'm doing right now. It's been a busy morning, man. But hey, staying busy is good. Skull Ranger will give me green edit style as well. Survival Specialist, I like this. Whistle Warrior. Trooper. Commando, because we know some of you really love Commando. That looks good. A lot of people like Assault Trooper, so there it is. And then the Suki. So again, just land at Gotham City with your preferred skin to preview this back bling on. And you can see what it looks like. Don't forget that. 
24 outfits with the jeweled cat backlink from Catwoman. Now, it reminded me of this mask when I saw it in game. So let's do the dark, the dark styles here. This is what it reminded me of. It's almost, <laughs> it's almost funny. It's almost like you're turning it around to roughly the same thing. It still looks pretty cool though. It might, it still might look good on the white too. Oh yeah, with the jacket, it looks really good. But oh, that looks good. Lynx, um, probably the dark one as well, the dark style. It's kind of like a gimme there. A lot of people are saying that <laughs> the, the Catwoman we got is a downgraded um, Lynx. I don't, I mean, I don't know, man. Maybe just keep an open mind and appreciate that we even got anything Batman related. I think it's fine. It looks cool. This looks good on her edit style. I did all of the dark um, rarity outfits as well here. They look really good on them. Wonder looks good. Let me talk to your manager. Part two. Not bad. Cryptic. Looks pretty good. Dream. I like it. World Warrior. Doesn't really have any block on her, but I think it looks okay. Recon Ranger. Bullseye. Volley Girl. Riot. It looks pretty good with his hair color. And then Mika Micah. So my favorite one. Man. I kind of like it on. Mm, damn, it's tough. Favorite one. I'm going Catalyst with her, um, her black color scheme. Yeah, I like that. It looks really cool. Now we have the Dark Knight cape, and I think it's my favorite one, actually. Like, in terms of that top buckle right there, it really gives you a lot more opportunity to kind of make it look even better than just the all black one that we have. Molten Battlehound looks great. Shogun, super bulky, but ah, that one's a stretch. I think it looks okay on the scientist, actually. The ultimate knight. Oh, the gold looks really good. Let's do the, the super juicy one. I like that style. Silver, not so much. Red, not bad on the red, but the gold looks really good. Now, it's more of like a bronze buckle on there, but it goes well with her rounds. I like that. Around her chest looks good. Steel sight looks okay. Sophia looks great. I like Red Strike, looks really cool. I've, except the hood's kind of glitching through a little bit. Mary Marauder, Burnt Edda style, I like it. The Daring Duelist, it looks really good on her. They got for mask, doesn't really matter, but just in case you were curious, George. Blue Squire, I love that, it looks really cool. Disco Diva, not as bright of a gold as she wearing, but I like it. Laguna looks juicy. Winnegade Wado looks really good. You're gonna see this a lot from Renegade Raider owners. I'm telling you right now, you're gonna see that a lot. Rio Grande looks pretty damn good as well. I like that. Sash, Sarn looks okay. I don't showcase him enough. Tracker, I like it on Tracker. Sizzle Sergeant looks kind of cute. I like that. Scarlet Defender with and without her beanie. It, like, again, it's not necessarily a bright gold, but it's like a brushed? No. It's more of a bronze. Looks good on Aura, though. I like it. Assault Trooper again. Sweaty combo. And then Wingtip, because I don't give her enough love either. And my favorite one? Oh, man. I hate to say it. Crackshot looked really cool to me. But my favorite? Got him. Winnegade Wada. It looks really good on her. I really like that. And with that being said, guys, liking the video is always appreciated. Subscribing is free. And we'll see you nerds on the live stream. See ya!